Amidst her continued success in Hollywood, Oscar-winning actor Emma Stone is making a heartfelt revelation. She's ready to reclaim her real name, Emily. In a recent interview, Stone opened up about a decision to embrace her birth name, which is often reserved for close friends and co-stars. Despite being widely known as Emma professionally, Stone disclosed that her intimate circle frequently addresses her as Emily. During a joint interview with her, the Curse co-star Nathan Fielder announced his intention to use Stone's actual name, Emily, throughout the conversation. Stone graciously responded, expressing her openness to both names. Explaining the origin of her stage name, Stone revealed that it was chosen due to another actor already using a birth name in the Screen Actors Guild. However, a few years ago, she experienced a shift in perspective, leading her to reconsider her professional moniker. Stone candidly shared, For some reason, I was like, I can't do it anymore. Just call me Emily. Despite her decision, she acknowledged that some colleagues, like Fielder, find it easier to address her as M. The Poor Thing star expressed her appreciation for fans who might address her as Emily, indicating a willingness to embrace her true identity. Fielder, in a gesture of understanding, pledged to use both names during the interview. While Stone has always been credited as Emma in her professional endeavors, her affinity for the Spice Girls and her favorite member Emma Bunton inspired a choice of stage name. During a past appearance on The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon, Stone humorously recounted her childhood desire to be called Emma, influenced by her love for baby spice. Well, you're watching US Most Read. If this information was useful for you, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and share this news with others as well. See you in the next video. Thank you.